Start with a brutal attack on a busy street in broad daylight. New video from a surveillance camera showing a woman kicking and struggling as two men try to steal her purse in San Francisco's Stockton Tunnel. KPI X Files Andrea Borba is there. Just spoke to the victim about her terrifying ordeal. Andrea? This is surveillance video from Sunday morning at 9 10 a.m. when hairstylist Li Hua Yang became the victim of a horrific strong arm purse snatching at the mouth of the Stockton Street Tunnel in Chinatown. She was trying to get to work that morning. We spoke to her through a Cantonese translator. He uh, took my bag and then I tried to protect my back, so that's, that's why I hold it. But then he continues to drag, and then I, I fell down, and then he, uh, he dragged me through the tunnel. There are numerous cameras at the mouth of the tunnel that captured the attack. You can see Liwa get dragged across the sidewalk and eventually dumped into the gutter as the suspects made off with her purse and drove away. Tonight, she is covered in bruises and has a bump on her head. I went back home that day. I, I couldn't even stand up because because it's so, it was so painful. She lost her ID, credit card, iPhone, and 40 bucks when her purse was stolen. Lee Wah's attack happened just hours before a man was attacked while collecting cans in the Bayview. President of the Board of Supervisors, Norman Yee, says it has to stop. They're not really seeing that we're human beings and we're all struggling to actually survive in the city. And it's in particular the victims that I, I've been seeing, that they're not they're not necessary uh, fill resources. For her part, Liwa says she is permanently changing her route to work. I'm too scared to walk that uh, Stockton Street tunnel again. No more. I, I won't walk that tunnel because that tunnel is already very dark. Now, SFPD says they are looking for three suspects in this case tonight. Of course, they have that car on surveillance video. They want Lee Wa to feel like she is being supported by her community, and they want others to feel like they are safe here as well. Live in San Francisco's Chinatown, Andrea Borba, KPIX 5.